around 9 o'clock uh, p.m., give or take, uh, the Lawrence County 911 received a call about a shooter at Ferry Park Hospital. Our officers arrived to the scene very quickly along with the Lawrence County Sheriff's Office. Uh, immediately, they made contact with a suspect who fired his weapon at the officers, uh, striking one of the deputies in the leg. Our officer was able to return fire back towards that suspect. He ran back into the hospital. More shots were fired. Uh, shortly after that, um, I believe about 9.40, somewhere, give or take, uh, the suspect came outside. Uh, actually, I was standing there along with uh, Post Commander for Georgia State Patrol and our officers, and we were able to arrest him without incident. Uh, several searches was done to make sure that we only had one perpetrator. Uh, after about nine, maybe ten searches of the hospital, making sure that everything was safe, we were able to get the hospital back up and running. Uh, the weapon was also recovered from the scene, and the investigation is continuing at this time were fired in the building itself mm -hmm. or what can you tell us about that? Well uh, at that particular time you can imagine a lot of chaos but quickly uh, the staff uh, did what they were trained to do. About two and a half weeks ago our department carried out a active shooter training at Fairview Park Hospital and I believe because of the training and everything that was done to prepare them for incident uh, not knowing that something like this would happen uh, I believe countless, countless lives were saved because of their quick thinking and how they carry themselves uh, during a stressful, stressful situation. Where was this crime scene kind of unfolding? Well, the uh, actual shooting uh, happened in multiple places, uh, the main entrance being the first and the main area where the majority of the shots were fired in a side door. Uh, at this time, I don't want to get into all the particulars of what happened um, because the investigation is continuing at this time. What can you tell us about the suspect? Uh, Keem Woodard, uh, in his 20s, uh, he was at the hospital on Thursday, stayed over on Friday with some issues that he was having. Um, uh, he was waiting to uh, be transferred to another location. Somewhere in that, I'm, I'm not sure how he left, but we know he returned back and uh, the situation happened. So someone in the hospital saw him with a gun and called authorities? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Anything else you'd like to add about another officer shot in the line of duty in Georgia? Well, it's, it's just a uh, trying time we're, we're living in now. If you look at Georgia, we have had several lives to be lost, uh, a lot of officers injured, uh, the violence seemed to grow and grow, and uh, we're grateful for our citizens here in Dublin who really support us and our government, and uh, we're grateful as well for our law enforcement community who came out to assist us uh, with this situation.